Hello everybody and welcome back to And We've Gone Country. I just wanted to give you a little update today on the round pen. So I believe I showed you uh, this pile before of, of uh, different size stone that we've got going here. This, as you can see, is a new one. So Andy already went through the uh, large sized stone that we had and the medium sized stone that we had down here. And now he's brought in this really fine stuff. So there's it's like little, little actual like pulverized pieces of stone in there and it's super tiny. So this should be the last bit that we need to really compact it down. All the other stone has been placed, which is awesome. So we're moving along pretty good. Andy's been working really hard. So um, I'll show you in a second here. They've, he put a stake down in the middle to keep the measurements accurate, um, which obviously is important. And he's put layer after layer of all different stone. And then he just got back from Menards, picked up some more of the black layering stuff to keep weeds from coming up and keep stones from coming up into the sand. Um, I thought we had enough, but he doesn't think so. <laughs> so he went and got that. He hasn't started laying it yet, but he does have the materials. Although he said he was looking for the, the um, staples, the ground staples to keep them secured to the ground. And we did buy them, but naturally we can't find them. So as we're heading our way back there, I just wanted to show you another thing I get to work on today. As you can see, that bottom layer of the fence has all come down. That little one in the corner there is a pressure point and it often breaks. I know I got, I've shown you guys how to do that before. It happened again, so I gotta fix that really quick before it gets dark. It is getting darker more and more early every night. That's unfortunate. Um, it's obviously we can get less and less done, but we're doing the best we can. Ooh, you see the pretty little turkey? <laughs> getting pretty big, aren't ya? I don't think this is even the biggest one though. The other one's bigger. They're all growing really quick. Lots and lots of lavender babies in here. The other turkeys in there still. So Andy's watering right now. He's gonna compact it one more time before putting down the the black stuff. I forget what it's called. So this is the surface. Hi honey. Hi. Hi. <laughs> you want to explain to everybody what you're doing? I am watering the round pen. This is fun. Isn't it? Oh my gosh. Look and what's the, the what's the surf what's the um the reasoning behind watering it before you compact it? It's so that way it solidifies to each other. That's the purpose of doing the watering. If you don't do that, it's not gonna compact solid. We're doing it again because our family of chickens is having fun playing in here. So yeah, they've been digging in it. So, so that stuff that you brought in today—is there a special name for that kind of gravel? Uh, it's TB. TB stands for traffic on. Oh, okay. I thought that's what it was, but I thought that's what the other smaller stuff was. This is even smaller than the other stuff we got, though. Yeah, there's, there's three different sizes you can get for TV, depending on... Oh, okay. But uh, I wanted to make sure we had enough water drainage. Mm -hmm. So I went with the one and a quarter first to make sure it was going to drain good. So we're going to have a water puddle with it. Right, yeah, it's not going to help. It is looking pretty solid for people to walk on, but as you can see, it doesn't take much to move it. And um, you put a thousand pound animal with a smaller surface area hoof in there, and it won't take much to dig it up. So, gotta compact just a little bit more. Were you able to find the staples for the ground? No? Ugh, darn it. What else would we have done with those things? I know. Every day is shorter and shorter. Sucks. 
All right, well, that's all the updates for today. Just wanted to keep you guys up to date on the progress just so you can see the process of actually putting together a round pen for yourself. There's a lot of different ways to do it, but this is the way that we're choosing to do it. Um, just because we have clay ground. I don't think everybody has to do quite as much as we've done, but um, I plan on using it a lot. <laughs> so I want to make sure that none of those stones come up into the sand. So, all right, so that's all for today. Got a little rooster here. They're starting to grow up. Anyways, you guys have a good night and we'll uh, check in again and see the progress. Hopefully it'll be just maybe a couple weeks or so before we get that round pen finished. Can't wait to ride in it. <laughs>